people say to us, pull back to the borders of 67, and then there will be peace. We were in the borders of 67, in June in 67, and in May 67. Why was there war? And immediately after the war, we said, let us sit down and negotiate peace. They didn't do it. Has there been a single moment since 1967 when you thought that the Arabs were ready to talk? No. Their quarrel with the Arabs is not a quarrel for a piece of land. It's not for territory. It's not for anything concrete. They just refuse to believe that we have the right to exist at all. Why did they leave? Well, many of them were refugees of war. Maybe they don't like a conquered but army. Who made, who made the war? What did we take away from the Arabs when we came back? We didn't want to live with them in, in peace. We asked them to leave. We didn't accept the partition of Mr. Churchill in 1922 and the partition of the UN in 1947. We didn't say yes. What difference is there between Arabs who were on this side of the Jordan and the other side of the Jordan? Arabs in the East Bank and the uh, west of the border of the West Bank? I mean, where, when were Palestinians born? What was, uh, what was all this area before the First World War? When Britain got the mandate over Palestine, what was Palestine then? Palestine was then the area between the Mediterranean and the Iraqian border. You say there's no such thing as East and West Bank? No. East and West Bank was Palestine. I'm a Palestinian. From 21 until 48, I carried a Palestinian passport. There was no such thing in this area as Jews and Arabs and Palestinians. There were Jews and Arabs. I would say there are no Palestinians, but I say there is no such thing as a distinct Palestinian people. Why have the Palestinians in the West Bank become more Palestinians since the 5th of June 67 than they were before? Why didn't they set up a Palestinian uh, country in addition to Jordan? Done. They should have set up another independent Palestine and fought from there. They didn't do that. They adopted the fact that they are in Jordan. They've adopted the Jordanian citizens. They are the majority in Jordan. They are in parliament. They are in government. What has happened since? Why have they become more Palestinian conscious since the war of 67? Everybody is, has the right to self-determine except we. We're the only people in the world to whom it does not give the rights to, for self-determination. I came here, I came to Merhavia when there was nothing there. The, uh, this land was deserted for centuries. We were driven out of this land. Is this where history begins? Twice we were driven out of this land, occupied by other powers. The Arabs, the, this is the only people, the Jewish people, whose life, independence, dignity, depends on this piece of soil. The only people in the world, not the Arabs. They have this entire territory, the entire vast area. Fourteen independent countries.